Hello there, it's now time for business. Oxford professor Noel Tego says government Ijapa royalties deal, which sparked some controversy, should not be cancelled but be subjected to a national debate. It's three months now since the Ijapa royalties deal was suspended, but according to Professor Tego, the debate should look at the valuation process, alternatives, as well as a possible mixture of financing national spending. People collateralize uh, their earnings all the time. So think about you having a pension. Okay, you can uh, choose to take your pension <clears throat> every month after you retire, or you can choose to take your pension in a bulk sum, mm -hmm. and you can, or you can choose to take your pension as a mixture, a bulk sum to start with, and then some annual earnings from that. A few things you need to think, think about when you're doing that. You need to make sure that the valuation is right. And the valuation depends on various kinds of assumptions. So for transparency's sake, make the assumptions known. And let's have a debate on that. That's number one, the valuation. Let's have a debate on that. Uh, number two then is what alternative means are there to raise funds? And how do they compare with this? Let's have a conversation about that. So then you have a portfolio or a mix of funding, some a japa like funding, some just go on the commercial market to, to, to borrow, and so on. So, so that is number two in terms of that. Number three is that within what development framework are you collateralizing these things? Would you say then that it's been suspended for now? We, should we bring it back for a conversation? Well, and well I, think that, I think we, we need conversations broadly on financing uh, that takes in, into consideration things like EJAPA, things like borrowing money, etc. If, if in the, uh, 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 we, we have not been able to kind of expand our tax base. But what I'm saying is this, that uh, once you, you, you put it within a framework and you say, okay, we're going to use it, let's say, to fund real infrastructure. Mm -hmm. How much, by how much, I mean, how, uh, what real infrastructure, how much is it going to lift up GDP, all things being equal? Mm -hmm. And then when we fund, we're going to come back and do an impact assessment mm -hmm. to say this is what is happening. So I think, I mean, most people have not understood uh, EJAPA and some of the uh, conversations that have taken place are really uninformed, uh, uh, this thing. But that's part of the suspicions and the banding of um, accusation back and forth. My understanding, in limited understanding of the politics around EJAPA has been about conflict of interest of central players in exactly, government. Exactly. I mean, that should stop. It's just cure the conflict of interest. That's the easiest thing to do.